Hi everyone, Aiden here with eTrailer. Today we're going to be taking a look at and be showing you how to install the SEPA custom fit towing mirrors on our 2024 Ram 1500. Now the main feature here is that these are custom fit. All the plastics are going to be custom molded to fit around the different shapes and contours of your Ram. And it gives you a pretty solid fit overall. But one thing to note about this one compared to some other options like the ones from Longview or K-Source is that our RAM has turn signals on the factory mirrors and those different towing mirrors had cutouts so you could still see them, whereas this is one solid piece. You're gonna lose those features on your RAM if you have them. These are also pretty bulky compared to those other custom options. And one of the issues with that is seen in this bottom corner when you try to fold the mirror in, it does make contact with your vehicle and you can't fully fold your mirrors in. They can leave them here, it'll save space. But if you wanted to pull into a parking spot and fully fold these in so that you just don't have to worry about it sticking out so far, these ones aren't gonna do it the best. Now the main reason you're getting towed mirrors though is to widen your field of view. The factory mirrors on your Ram do have that small blind spot mirror in the upper corner and that will help, but they're small and it's gonna be hard to see things. To their credit, these mirrors from SEPA have a really large mirror face and will help give you that wider field of view. The larger mirror face will just make it easier to see things and help you make lane changes, turns, and park just a little bit easier. And when comparing this to a universal mirror, it's still gonna be leaps and bounds more stable and secure. So you're gonna get less rattle and vibration going down the road, meaning that you get a clearer and easier view through the mirror. Now you can get these in a pair, or you can get these individually. So if you just want the driver's side, you can just pick up the driver's side and same goes for the passenger. They install the exact same way though. This is the passenger side that we'll show you right now. And the only thing you really need to take note of is this threaded hole, it'll be towards the top. We'll slide the SEPA mirror over our factory mirror and push it forward as far as it'll go. And I'm just gonna start this hand knob here and thread it down a little bit because eventually what that's gonna do is push on the backside of this wedge piece and basically lock the towing mirror in place. But I'll thread that down and just feel on the inside to make sure it doesn't actually start poking out. That way it's a little easier when we slide that wedge piece in. And on the wedge, the thicker part is gonna be facing up. So that'll line up there's a lip on the inside that we can push against push that in and thread that further we should feel it kind of grab on and if i can still pull this out that means things are probably not super well lined up just back that out and keep threading it in until i get it to line up where i want it this part's really tricky because you're just going in blind. Once you do have it lined up, just thread it down the rest of the way till it stops and give it a good shake test. There's gonna be a little bit of wiggle room in here, but I can't actually pull that off. So we know that wedge is doing its job and it's hooked onto the mirror properly. So overall, if I'm being honest, it's not my favorite. It's not the easiest install. It's not the best fit and it doesn't give you really the largest mirror face. I'd say it comes pretty much in line with the K-Source mirror, that's equally as large, so you're gonna get pretty similar visibility out of both of them. But where the K-Source really separates itself is a much more solid install, a much better custom fit, and in my mind, that makes it a much better mirror and a better fit for the RAM. But if you're just looking for an upgrade over some universal mirrors, or you maybe just need the one side, you're really not too concerned with getting a pair, then maybe the SEPA set could be the one for you in your 2024 Ram 1500. Thanks for watching.